What is up and I welcome each and every one of you back to a brand new Civ 6 or Civilization 6 video. Back at it with Scotland and we are about to go to war with Kaguana. Skipped a few turns just to get everybody into position. I really don't know what to do with this builder at this point, although a farm, a few farms is probably the better idea. Yeah, I'll do this. is going to be a really, really strong city, especially if we could get some housing in it. We'll go get the granary first. Uh, governor title-wise, I think we'll just go grants. I guess, and do we still need um, Bengal and Mexico City? Yeah, we do. We're barely positive loyalty in here. But as we grow, we should be a little bit better. There's an encampment down there, so we do have to be careful of that. Get a nice free builder here. He can chop everything, and we are going to go to war in the next turn. So they do have a barbarian encampment they're dealing with right now. But I, I let me just focus on Kaguana right now. Declare war. Boom. Let's attack them. Nobody knows who they are, who they are, so I doubt we lose too much in um, whatever the thing is called. Uh, too much aggression. Whatever, whatever that thing is called. Oh my... I completely forgot to move the battering ram into position first. Okay, then. Well... Uh, I have no idea what I'm talking about right now. It has been one of those days. I, I don't know what to do with this builder right now. But this guy's easy. You go You go ahead and start chopping everything. Let next turn. She wants horses. Let's do that. Let's hope she doesn't Catherine those horses, though. I, do, I did not breed those horses to be penetrated. And the game's paused. All right, then. Well, a crash in the first minute. That is a new world record. Let's... Okay, let's... <laughs> Let's just get I'll, I'll go the city and buy the encampment tile before he can really do anything. Where did they get? How did they? How did they steal the builder? Where? Oh, he probably died to the uh, quad dream or something. That's fine. Uh, we really don't need all these archers here, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, steal that builder back. Yeah, I'll go steal that builder back. You can move up there. You can move there. And yeah, there we go. That's the damage I'm looking for. Perfect. I want to take that builder before I. Okay, that's fine. We'll be able to get him, like, right now. So let's take the builder. Cool. We'll attack you. That's fine. In a few turns, you should be able to settle that city, I would think. Let's hope you don't get stolen by a barbarian. So you can go ahead. Boom, 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 boom. And then you're going to just, um... I think you go ahead and take out that pikeman before anything really happens. Uh, you're gonna skip your turn. You were gonna hit him with that chip-chop combo. Something. You get a mine, and then we'll chop mine that. Let's go ahead and finish off the city-state of Kaguana. And then that should be a one-shot. Very nice, and that is the third and final city-state we are going to be eliminating. And I moved Amani to Mitla, right? I should have. Where's Amani? Okay, now we'll move her to Mitla. She really has no military. We could probably go for Eleanor as well. Not going to take that risk, though. Uh, I could go for some more tea. I do want to go chop that. And let's harvest this farm so we get more food. And then you actually are going to need some help. So you're going to stay fortified. We could upgrade to... Ooh, I'm thinking right now. Eleanor is looking pretty thick right now. Are those ancient walls? She has no military strength, doesn't doesn't she? Hold on. Okay, my mic was. You know what? We'll go for Eleanor right now. We'll see if we can go for Eleanor. I don't know if we're going to be able to, but we'll see if we can go for Eleanor. Uh, but first things first, you guys are going to go down and deal with these barbarians. Here, this guy could just go there, get a farm, boom, food, awesome, nice, get a pasture for some production, uh, even though it had nothing to do with me, so I don't know why I even got that notification. But let's keep going. You can just uh, go get like a lumber mill or something. And then here, a nice campus right over there, actually. You know, that's plus three. We'll sacrifice some production. Kaguana's a really, really nice city. Uh, you're going to attack. You're going to attack as well. Make sure you can't kill my guy. Uh, we'll hit next turn now. Uh, you're going to promote, and you're going to... I want to move and pillage that, but I know this quadrant's going to do a lot to me. Needs orders now. Let's make friends and ally with Gorgo just so she doesn't attack me. Alliances. Let's actually get a military alliance. Because we're going to, I'm going to try to get her to join in on the war against uh, her, what, what's her face? And then five combat strength is absolutely massive for that. I'm going to do that. There's a World Congress now. I think this is probably going to be scientific. Let's try to make this me. I highly doubt it though. Do we, do we have suzerainty of Mitt? We do. Nice. Oh, wow. I actually won both. Cool. Uh, so Mitla's gonna be fine. You're gonna settle that city, Haddington. Again, Birmingham is such high population that we don't even really need to take London if we can't. Like, I could just move in, blitz, take out Birmingham, and then make peace if it's not looking too well. Move and disperse. It's also gonna give him, yep, that's enough error score to get into a normal age now. Uh, we'll be able to move him back as well. 12 error score to a golden age. I highly doubt we're able to do that. Like, oh. Oh my god, look at that city. <laughs> Look! Look at all these yields! Oh my god, this is gonna be our best city. This is gonna be even better than our capital. Absolutely insane. Let's start moving in this guy. You can move in up there. We're gonna get the builder here in Sterling. You know what? Maybe getting a swordsman's a better idea. 
I think actually buying a swordsman and then upgrading him into a man at arms. I understand that, but by the time we have these two iron mines, we're going to be able to get a, uh, we'll be able to get a swordsman after that. So here we'll just get a granary. Uh, you're going to move, I guess you can move there or something. You guys are going to fortify. You're actually going to move back to the front lines. Let's keep going now. Builder time. Uh, go chop the jungle. We'll hit next turn. She has a lot of science per turn, but again, no military strength. So I'm really not too worried about her. Let's get lumber mills because it's only like one turn. All right, you should be able to just smack them. And then here, delegation. Okay, that's some nice diplo visibility. All right, you're going to get a monument. You're going to get me another mine. And then you are going to go and get me a... Give me a corporation up there, actually. All right, cool. Go get a mine up there. We'll hit next turn. Uh, should be able to buy a swordsman soon-ish. Let's wipe this guy out for a fact. So I guess we could try to get some gold. We could get a galley. Two error score. Oh no, we're one error. There's no way. There is no way we're one error score. Come on. Come on. Come on. Where's the error? Oh, I forgot to enable that, I think. All right, what could give me one error score immediately? Um, crap. Uh, maybe repair that. Oh, there's nothing I can do. Is there getting a corporation maybe? Oh no, we are positive error score. What happened? First luxury monopoly on the world. Yes, that was it, right? No, that was marble. Marble saved us. All right, we're going to be in a heroic age, actually. That is so big for us right now. Absolutely insane. Let's get a granary up there. Here, you can just go get, especially if Eleanor's in a dark age, it might just be game over at this point. I uh, can go battle cry now. We'll see, though. There's a heroic age. Nice. And she's still in a normal age. That's fine. Uh, I could go for monumentality. I think I'm just going to go. For, oh, we could go for three. Never mind. Man, these all suck. Kind of regret the Golden Age now. A great Admiral somehow. I don't know why. Uh, I guess we'll give combat strength to naval units. That's that's pretty nice. Uh, could we get an industrial zone? We can get a plus three right there. Let's get it right over there. And then you can just go there and like get a farm or something. Just help out the housing. Get a quarry. Move in there. Smack them. Cool. In a few turns, we should be able to, especially if... All right, I'll accept that deal, actually. Um, get a mine. He doesn't have to work out. You can wipe him out. Cool. And then you're going to get how much experience? 10? That should be decent enough, I guess. Give me a mine up there. Awesome. Dundee's looking good. We just need housing and amenities. Okay. Um, production-wise in this city now. Fine. Uh, here now we'll go surplus logistics. Probably should have went provision a while ago. But uh, it's okay. It's cool. Uh, we can actually buy a... Not buy a swordsman right now. All right, well, apparently we didn't get the tech for it. Uh, okay, you're going to back out there and then promote. Now, do they still have ancient walls? They do. So we do... We're making a lot of money, though. That's the thing. Like, we're making enough money, I think. We could probably get everything we need. Uh, we need production, though, in this city. So just go get some production. There's another city-state, Antiti Navarro. You're going to stay fortified. We'll hit next turn. We get some culture out of it. Again, blitz Eleanor. Take at least Birmingham. If we could just blitz Birmingham and take that city, I'll be happy. So she's not negative money. Mercenaries might be good to upgrade. I think mercenaries instead of that. That's fine. And then we could go for natural philosophy instead of colonization. Cool. So our science has skyrocketed a quite a bit. So just get the campus right there. Uh, here now you're going to get yourself a... Wow, you need everything in this city. Give me a builder. Yes, and then we'll get Kumasa. We could settle this continent. That's nice. Uh, let's go back to Sterling, actually, I think. Actually, we might as well trade. Yeah, yeah, we'll trade with uh, Eleanor just to get as much gold as possible. So we can we can buy one in a few turns. And then three man-at-arms. Okay, cool. Three man-at-arms. We could get the next one in two turns, and then we'll upgrade to a siege tower. Nice, wipe him out and get a promotion. And then, yeah, three man-at-arms, just blitzing the enemy city. Uh, you're going to back out and attack. Haha, <laughs> he can't get out. He can't come on me. That's funny. Uh, let's get in... Where'd you get the... Oh, you already had an industrial zone. Where? What? Is that the industrial zone? Really? Oh my god, I completely messed up then. Uh, alright, we're not gonna be able to have any of this over there, so that kind of sucks. Uh, we, we can at the... Oh, that's a plus three campus. Give me that. No matter the cost and resources. Uh, you're going to promote now. We'll give you, like, Emblem. Wait, next turn. We're gonna buy the man-at-arms this turn now. Then we're going to save up until we can upgrade the Battering Ram. I'm not going to wait for the Battering Ram because they still have Ancient Walls, right? 
they do still have ancient walls. Although I am curious, what if, like, do siege towers do, like, really, really good against ancient walls? That's my question. Hmm, we'll have to get that answered, I think. All right, you're gonna move back there. Uh, you're gonna, okay, we're gonna do that. Um, where are you? You're going to move one, two. No, if you move there, then you can one, two, and attack immediately. Give it to me. Give it to me. Now, she is... We are in a golden age. So, error score, or uh, loyalty-wise, we should be fine. Yeah, you can move, and then... Let's see. How much damage? Okay. That's a lot of damage to the walls. And then you can move there. You can move there and, like, begin pillaging or something. You're gonna move there. If this doesn't work out, it's fine. And we'll promote you, actually, and then attack. Urban Warfare. I think I'm gonna go Tortoise first, actually. Trade route, we'll just uh, we'll just go to Sterling, get a nice safe trade route going. Again, you stay asleep. We should be able to finish off the walls in the next turn. Uh, so hit next turn. This guy's going to move in and attack, though. Stay there for some reason. We got exploration, so let's just go exploration now. And we are going to get the oligarchic legacy policy for now, because I do want that extra combat strength still. We'll go back to conscription, though, and then here we'll just go merchant confederation. And plus two influence points. I think that's the best for now. Yep, and then we'll go Naval Tradition for a few bands. Uh, you're going to attack. You're going to attack. You guys... Okay, well, that's this is going to be an issue, isn't it? Hmm. Fortify. Fortify. I guess you can move there and fortify for now. They, oh my god, I should have done that. Because now we get five extra combat strength, don't we? We should. Or does it only work against her units? I think it might only work against her units then. Um next turn okay that's that's okay actually special session no 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 no. don't give her money actually okay well it was it, there was no chance in me not passing that or them not passing that so attack that uh you're going to attack that you're gonna back out you can pillage next turn you're gonna stay fortified i'm trying to get that guy out of the city now give me a watermelon this guy can actually come to sterling as well uh, move there. Lumber mail. We'll get a farm soon. Let's hit next turn. There's Harold Hadrada. Nice. Let's try to get him in on the war as well. I don't know how join ongoing war against Eleanor. 1T. Nice. Perfect. Cool. Anything with quick deals I can make. If I could just quadrate him, actually. Just so I can surround the city and make it easier on me. Okay, he's going to attack the crossbowman. That's a very bold decision. But, uh, yeah. This quadrate now. Surround the city. Surround the city. You can attack. You actually can promote. So you're going to finish him off. You're going to pillage that. You're going to attack the city. We don't need the siege tower anymore. We'll go for guilds now. Man, London's going to be pretty strong as well. Uh, get me a watermill now. This guy can just go pasture. Okay, I think I think we're doing fine for now. Bologna's going to be big. Bologna is massive when it comes to... Oh, yes, that's going to be massive for us. Go there, get a farm for some housing, we'll hit next turn. See what happens here? Yep, that's fine, that's fine. We lost the crossbowman, but the city is a hundred times weaker now. Uh, so if we could actually finish this guy off in one turn, and I think we can. So attack, attack, you attack, so I think that was worth it in the end. If they soften it up, yeah, just lube it up a little bit and finish the city off. Birmingham and the loyalty should not be an issue because it's an issue. Nine populate. I don't get it, man. I don't get how loyalties. Please tell me how loyalty is an issue in any sort of capacity. Come on. Six, I'm in a golden age. Don't do this to me. We're going to have to beeline London then. We'll get you. I don't know what you can do. I guess we could use you in Mexico City. It doesn't matter. And here we'll just get a library. This is 16 turns now. I'm gonna I think I want to buy another man at arms if I can. Again, she really doesn't have too much to fit. If I take out London, that probably breaks the camel's back. I'll take your delegation. Alright, she has 107 combat strength now. Uh you can actually go and explore up a little bit. There's nothing up there. You can promote to tortoise. You guys are gonna fortify. You're gonna fortify. We'll upgrade you to a siege tower, actually. And then we'll wait till we can buy a second man at arms. We don't think the siege tower gives any sort of bonuses yet, though. Should have moved him there, huh? Well, you can move up there. You're moving in down. You can move and attack. We'll be able to surround the city next turn. I just want to get some good damage on off it now. Uh, so keep your turn. You can probably pillage that next turn. Oh, yeah, that's a lot of damage. Man, my boats do a lot of damage. Okay. Okay, that was a city attack. That's fine. I thought she bought a unit. 
Um, okay, you're gonna move there. Okay, that's not good. Uh, oh, we don't have that tile. Not gonna be able to pillage. Hey, it doesn't, it doesn't really matter. We're, we're taking the city, like, very, very quickly, actually. Uh, you'd only get hit by one attack, so we're good to attack that. Uh, here in Dumfries, finish off the industrial zone. Get, get a, get a, get a builder. Just get a builder. Get a builder in this city of Dunder Mifflin. We're now number one in science, and that is without our unique abilities, by the way. Um, let's go for, let's just, ah, I don't, man, these cities suck. Who thought it was a good idea to buy to get these cities? Let's just get some sea turtles. Ah, uh, we can get a corporation there. You're actually going to back out for now, just in case we end up losing that guy. Let's get that corporation. Finish him off. Nice. Hit next turn. Uh, okay, that's cool. You should be able to promote. Not yet. Okay, then. Well, let's pillage with you. I'm not going to pillage with you, though. Um, okay, let's attack, because the city definitely dies this turn. You attack. You take the city. Nice. Sheffield's ours now. Lots of stuff boosted. Uh, Sheffield's at 7, so we should probably move... Oh, we got to... Okay, Pingala's in Mexico City anyway, so it's fine. Once we take London, that should be more than enough. Uh, so let's just repair the monument first for loyalty. Why is it only to the city center? Hmm, one of the questions science can't answer, I guess. They got pike and shots now. Ernst J.F. Armin the 8th, that's fine. Let's, uh... Wow, he's been destroyed. Holy crap, what happened to J.F. Armin? Yeah, this city's, this city's gonna be... I don't even know if we could take it, quite honestly. Let's do some minor wall damage then. Not unless we're able to get a siege unit. A catapult. I don't even I don't even think a catapult's gonna be good enough. Get stuck upon Trent at the very least. I think we should honestly just move on towards Leeds. I think Yeah, because there's no way we take the city, right? No, we have no chance against that city. So we're gonna back out next turn. Heck we'll even but yeah, there's no chance we take that city. Uh you're gonna move and hopefully defend some of my possessions next time. You can go and repair that when you can. Well it next turn. Right, you're gonna come in as well. And then we do good not good damage, but the bombard's gonna help us out a little bit, I guess. Uh we'll pillage this just so we like remove their iron though. Okay, that's fine. Pillage that. 216 gold, that's pretty big. Let's get military engineering actually. Maybe some ballista would help us. Uh, this city needs we need builders everywhere, man. Uh, no, actually, you're just going to get me a builder. Yeah. Cool. Um, we could attack now. I don't want to, though. I don't think that's the best thing. So just link up. Move there. Yeah, Siege Tower isn't going to be too, too helpful. Actually, we'll attack just because we... Yeah, the Bombard's not going to be able to help us out for too much longer. Go and get a Lumber Mill. Then we'll hit next turn. Let's hope it's... Okay, Pillage. That's fine. Okay, well, I did not think the Pike and Shot would be stronger than a Man-at-Arms. Okay, that's not good here either. We do get a lot of coal, though, so that's fine. Uh, okay, that's okay. Oh, we're in a Dark Age. This is big. Okay, she's also in a Dark Age. That's fine, then. That's completely, perfectly fine. Uh, we'll go Professional Sports. You're gonna stay fortified, but you'll also upgrade just to help defend the city a little better. I said fortified. Oh, my God, I don't even know what happened there. Uh, Alright, you're going to immediately switch to walls then. Yeah, I can only attack from two tiles, so they can't really do too much to us. Um, okay, get that. And then go ahead and just start chopping everything you can. Get me in that. Uh, Dark Age, though, is going to be pretty bad when it comes to... Yeah, we do have to actually end up taking this city. So stay fortified. You're going to stay fortified as well. We're not at war with these guys, no. So we'll wait till they actually take out the walls. You are going to now... Uh, you have one charge. Get me some more cotton. All right, you're going to promote now. We'll give you commando. Lit next turn. Uh, you're not attacking the city anymore. That's very much not good. That is very much not good. Okay, then. Uh, all right, there's that. Military engineering, that's fine. You're going to go there. Stay fortified. Just uh, just stay fortified a little bit. We'll hit next turn. Let's see what they do. All right, cool. Now we take the city. Very nice. We're not doing anything. Although I do want to steal great works if I am going to make peace with her. Okay, we're going to get Stoic upon Trent uh, next turn, I think. Yes. All right, so finish this guy off. Cool, it's a city of Leeds. Should not be... Okay, still somehow negative loyalty. Don't understand how. Really, I'm, I'm confused on how it's negative loyalty. Uh, so Sheffield now should be fine, right? Apparently not. Apparently this game's absolute fucking bullshit. All right, well, um, we're going to have to take their capital then. 
All right, how much... Okay, I think a lot of it's just war. If we just make peace, I feel like we'd be fine. Uh, nearby Great Works is three. 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 Okay. Stoic should be fine. So here's what I'm thinking. If we could just make peace with her and take all her Great Works. No, 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 no. We need everyone. All right. Give me a library in this city. Uh, here now, we're going to just get me Medina Quarter. And then if we could just get any sort of amenities whatsoever. Retainers, that's fine. Just amenities. Praetorium's going to give me more loyalty. Two loyalty, actually. I think Praetorium's is better than Charismatic Leader. Colonial Office isn't, isn't going to help. Liberalism is fine. We'll get that instead of Oligarchic Legacy for now. So what's amenities looking like in these cities now? Negative three, negative one, so you should be fine, right? It says happiness level... Oh, I think... Okay. All right, but this, these cities should be a little bit fine now. I'm going to stay fortified. Fortify, fortify. I do want to see if I could just continue going for right now. Okay, let's hit next turn. I don't want to leave London alone. That's the thing. Okay, you're fine. Okay, these guys are fine now. We fixed the problem a little bit. Um... Cool. We're going to hit... I think, we, I think we need trebuchets on. I think we actually need bombards. So we could just get like one or two, like even buy the bombards. Yeah, let's go get one or two bombards. We'll heal up a little bit. Uh, here now, again, we need entertainment complexes. We have not made use of our unique ability whatsoever. Not in the slightest. But let's hit next turn. This builder's just going to repair everything, I think. And then you're going to... Ah, crap. Just get, get me an industrial zone. One over there. I think that one over there is the better idea because we could get an aqueduct. Um, you're going to now go up there. You're going to move there and then just defend everything cool okay uh can you upgrade to a frigate you can that ah nah it, it's too far away for me to frigate attack him leads now 17 turns it's fine for now give me a campus prepare some turtles next turn again okay okay i think we're look we're looking much better now especially okay let's try to make this me and then let's try to make this a uh, steel tech boost. I don't really matter. Yeah, we're number one in science by far. I think we've pretty much won the game already. Got a great scientist. Give me a coal power plant. And you just need... Man, you... Man, we're struggling right now. I'm going to save up for a... Uh, whatever his name is. A uh, few... If we could get two bombards, I think it's fine. Go get me that. Cool. Because I do think that's still medieval walls, right? Yes, it's still medieval walls. Okay, then. So let's start moving everybody into position now. Everybody move into position. Leeds is going to be an issue. Ooh, we could get Musketman now. We can actually get Musketman now. All right, let's hit next turn. A few Musketmen. We're going to need some Niter as well, I would think. Uh, That's fine. What is that even? Oh, my God. Why are there so many of their units here? I don't get it. Uh, Go and just get me a coal power plant. And then here, if you get a builder to go down there, we still need that city up there. I don't think we're going to get it. Um, you guys can move up there. You're gonna move up there. Again, I still think a Bombard is the better idea. It's 10 combat strength difference, though. Oh, okay, what if I move you out of the city, though? Okay, four- wow, just it's razor-thin margins, I guess. Uh, we'll hit next- so this guy has to stay in the city, actually. I'm not giving you that. I'll give you some tea, though. And cotton. Nice. Good, good, good. Alright, cool. So theoretically, how much? <sighs> I swear to God. I swear to God. I hate nothing more. I just want to remove barbarians from the game now. I truly, this is just absolute bullshit what happens with barbarians. It's not even any, it's not, it's not even anything tactical or anything. It's just spawn 500 different units and just go ahead and make his day terrible. I, come on now. I'm trying to make everybody's day fantastic. What are you talking about? What, what are you trying to do to me? All right, you're going to move there. Let's see how much damage a musketman can do to the city. With a uh, siege tower, obviously. You're going to stay fortified. You stay fortified. This guy's still not looking the best. We'll hit next turn. Lost his renity of Mitla. Not making peace with you. Let's hit next turn. Let's see now. There's mercantilism. I don't even think he attacked me that time. We still don't really do much here. Okay, well, we can actually start repairing everything now. On arena. Library. Give me a quarry. Uh, give me a coal power plant. Yeah, this isn't looking good right here. We'll finish the campus and then get some units. All right, so you're going to back out, actually. Uh, yeah, crap, I made a mistake. All right, then move in, then. 
Yeah, that's fine. And then we'll back these guys out. Okay, they got a flood. I'm hoping a flood comes to London and it just like absolutely destroys it. Uh, you're going to back out there. Stay fortified. Leeds is looking pretty not good right now. Can I buy a... I think I can. A monument should help a little bit. Let's uh, scientific theory. Chemistry into rocketry now. And uh, granary. Or just repair whatever you can, I guess. Repair all these farms. Um, get me... Can I chop that? No. Chop that then. Attack him. Cool. Amenities are negative everywhere. That's what you like to see. Uh, let's keep going, though. Just gotta make peace now. It's all war weariness. I guarantee it. The problem is Niter right now. Do you have... You have a lot of Niter, don't you? All right, can we make friends? And then get back our research alliance? And then maybe we could get the Niter? No? Yeah, they don't trade strategics for some reason. I have no idea why. The AI, ever, like, ever since the ever since the last few updates, the AI has just been so god-awful to deal with. They don't trade any... It's absolute bullshit sometimes. All the time, actually. We're gonna need some... Alright, listen, we're not gonna be able to do anything right now. So let's just make peace. Take some of her great works. Uh, give me that and that and that. Okay, what, what pressure... Okay, what great works do you have in that city? The Egyptian king, tumor, or something. You don't have anything. So how many cities do you have left? You literally just have Liverpool. Alright, so we'll make peace then. So you should have everything in this city, right? Oh, no, because it's her uh, thing over here, right? That probably... Okay, she's willing to trade with me now. We'll give you coal, and then I need how much? Probably around all your niter, actually. All the niter I can get, at least. Okay, that's good. It's actually very good. Upgrade into a musketman. I think you can move, and you can upgrade into a musketman. And then we'll blitz London with uh, two siege towers and musketmen then. I think that's the best idea. All right, cool. Move there and repair that. So how much would it cost for me to... Yeah, loyalty's so bad in these cities. I just need amenities right now. How much is a bombard now? A bombard's 1,120 gold. So see what deals we can make. Oh, wow, that's so much money. That is a lot of money. That is a lot of money. So we'll take that deal. I just want straight up gold. Then we'll take that deal. We can almost get one already. Okay, what about all my coal? Oh, wow, they're willing to get a lot for coal. Let's see. Especially Eleanor. Wow, and it's gold per turn only for some reason. All right, we'll accept that deal. Um, what about the Iliad or whatever? Okay, no one's willing to give me, like, actual gold for this stuff. Uh, what about more coal? We're fine on that end. All right, let's get gold per turn again. Cool, and I think that's good for now. Let's hit next turn. A lot of it was they did not have enough money to give me, actually. Uh, okay, we might... Yeah, this, these cities are going to go back to Eleanor. That's the problem. They're not even going to rebel and become free cities. They're literally just going to go back to Eleanor. So we do actually have to take this library. Now, we just need amenities right now. That's the thing. We just need amenities right now. Let's get Mitla and let's go towards Bologna. Cool. Um, okay, Birmingham, we just would have to put a governor. We're getting a governor title in seven turns. So I'm not worried about Birmingham. Not yet, anyways. The problem is Sheffield right now. That's the biggest issue right now. Uh, nearby Great Works. That's the thing. If I could just get the Great Works somehow. How did you get 50 of these? What? How did you get 50? Oh my god, that's what happened then. Repair that tile, and there's nothing I can harvest or anything. Uh, he doesn't like me. Apparently I have no place at Odin's dinner party. That kind of sucks. Uh, let's keep... Okay, well... Alright, we'll get the watermill in this city. Can I build units in these cities now? A trebuchet. Maybe I should just buy trebuchet. What's the difference? The difference is 10 strength, so honestly, if we could just get like two trebuchets right now. Alright, we're losing these cities anyway, so just get me trebuchets. Yeah, it's 800 gold still. That's fine. Uh, you are... Yeah, you're going to rebel actually extremely, extremely soon. So what I'm going to do... We, we could definitely get some money from Harold now. Yeah, 200 gold for, like, mar uh, coal. All right, what about a Diplo favor? We'll give you, like, 30. Make more equitable. What about, uh, 60? Okay, he doesn't want to give me gold. How much do I... I need 160. Oh my god, these guys are just pissing me off. Alright, give me that, and then I'll give you turtles, and then you can have all my Diplo favor. Just give me, just give it to me. Nice, okay, I just need the gold. I don't care how it's gotten, I don't care what... 
thing you're doing to get that goal. I just need it. All right, we'll get the trebuchet. Perfect. Moving back there. Nice. Uh, you're going to back out now, and then you are going to attack this guy. Cool. Okay, we have two trebuchets now. We have siege towers. I'm assuming there's still medieval walls. They are. So we're going to move you there. You can, uh, you have three movement speeds, so you can actually, hmm, you're fine. Actually, no, 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 no. You're going to link, and then, okay, well, not link, but you're going to move up there. You're going to move there, and then there, and then we'll attack in the next turn. Let's hit next turn now. Cool, 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 cool. Uh, Sheffield is going to rebel soon. I think we just leave Sheffield for now. I think Sheffield has to be left in for now, yeah. Uh, move there. And then this guy can actually move. Is that a hill? That's the question. That is a hill. So you can move. The, ah, but you'd get attacked twice. Yeah, just move in like that. Birmingham is now at eight turns. It's fine. Uh, get me a mine up there. Cool. You're going to get me, uh, I guess, get Assault Corporation. Why not? Uh, you're, you're just going to skip your turn. You're going to keep attacking him. They're just going to pillage everything. Trader out wise, you're going to stay asleep till I get another trader slot. So you're going to move there. Okay, I think we're fine then. Okay, we'll, we'll start the attack. Not next turn, but the turn after that. Yeah, Sheffield is already gone, so there really isn't much I could do about it. Shut up, timer. Holy crap. Okay, uh, you're going to... I think we declare war now because we get pushed out of Sheffield. Because it's going to go right back to her. So let's, let's just declare the war right now. If we make a cast a spell, I can't. Oh no, we still have three turns remaining on the peace deal, don't we? Oh, no. Um, that's very much not good, then. Okay, we'll stay there. Stay there. Uh, university there. University there. And then here, we'll just go and uh, do absolutely nothing. So just go back there. All right, then. You can just stay asleep for now. You're going to repair everything. All right, you're going to stay asleep. The problem is these amenities. So many negative amenities right here. We just have so many cities right now. We have 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 cities. Our science is absolutely skyrocketing, though. So once once we get the amenity problem sorted out somehow, especially by taking out uh, London. That's going to do it for this video. If you have enjoyed, don't forget to like and subscribe. Next time we come back, we're going to wipe out London off the face of the earth. We're going to make sure these guys are positive loyalty for the rest of the game. And we are going to fix the amenity problems. And without further ado, I will see you all in the next video. Peace.